Hi everyone, Nanny here from Nanny Cooks from the Ozarks. And have I got a little special treat for you today. I've been wanting to show you this recipe all summer long because it's a great summer dessert that's fast. You can freeze it and uh, you can use a prepared pie crust. Now don't you all go judging me over this, but it's, it's really good. My friend from Branson by the name of Shirley gave me this recipe and, and I want to share it with you today. First, I want to show you the few ingredients that are in it. It calls for, brand, or pardon me, powdered sugar, whipped topping, cream cheese, vanilla, and the toppings are pecans and coconut and drizzle a little bit of caramel sauce over the top of it. Now, how can you go wrong with all of those ingredients? So I'm gonna show you how quick this is to put together. And if you're having company over and you don't have a lot of time, this is the dessert you want to serve them. It holds its shape well. I won't say it's low calorie, that's for sure, but it has um, pecans and uh, toasted coconut on the top of it. So let's, I have already mixed one up because it will make two of these small graham cracker crust, or you could use a regular crust if you want to, or it will make one large graham cracker crust. So what I have done, here is I put my cream cheese and my powdered sugar in the mixer, mix it up really well. Then you add 16 ounces of Cool Whip, yeah, I said 16 ounces, and a teaspoon of vanilla. Mix that well. And that's the point we are right now. So I'm gonna take these out of here and we're just gonna scoop this in a, the prepared pie crust. See how firm it is and it holds its shape really well. Now, you probably saw this beater still had a little bit on it. Don't you worry, that's not going to waste. I don't know who'll get it first, hubby or me. Okay, now we're just gonna spread this out in the graham cracker crust or regular pie crust, whichever you like the best. I'm gonna get a spoon here so I don't waste any good stuff. And you can get as fancy or as plain as you want to be with this. Now, like I said, if you make it in a large graham cracker crust, it will be much taller too. Okay, we've spread it out. Now I have some toasted coconut here, and all you do to toast coconut is put a little in a shallow pan, put it in the oven at 300 degrees for about 10 to 12 minutes, and watch it closely because it will burn. So we're gonna sprinkle this coconut over it, and then we're gonna come back with some chopped nuts. Now I'm using pecans today, but you don't have to use pecans, whatever your favorite nuts are. And then as a finishing touch, we come back and drizzle this with a little bit of caramel sauce just to finish it up. That's it. We are done. Now, another thing about these prepared pie crusts is it comes with a clear cover that you can put on it and seal this up and put it in the freezer and it will keep two or three months in the freezer too. So, wasn't that fun and wasn't that fast? I've been wanting to share that with you all summer long. So, I'm gonna save this beater back here and I have one more thing I wanna show you today. You know, we have put out a cookbook and uh, I've heard a lot of comments on it and I love to hear your comments from it. So the next several videos for fall, we are going to be 
making fall and winter dishes, and all of the recipes will be in the cookbook too. We're going to make some popovers. Have you ever had a popover? They're fun to make and they're fun to eat. We're gonna make some apple crisp. Uh, we're gonna do some cashew chicken, and we're gonna fry some mush. If you've never had that before, you're in for a treat. Also, we're gonna make some hummus. So, I will put a link to the cookbook on this video, and be sure to watch the upcoming videos that have recipes from the cookbook. And also, I wanna remind you to subscribe and like our videos if you would, and be sure and share it with your friends too. So, I hope this is a go-to recipe for you in the future because it is good stuff. Have a good day and be kind to someone. Bye-bye.